Hi guys, uh, normally I make research videos which are prepared for, but in this video it's just going to be naturally me speaking because I didn't prepare for this video and I didn't plan on doing it. But today I tweeted the following tweet on Twitter which says, My Muslim wife stopped praying her five daily salah prayers by her own choice and her last Quran recitation made her feel disgusted by its message. She also started going to church with me by her own choice. Despite all that, she still says I'm Muslim, so keep praying guys. And then as you see, a Muslim responded by saying, I challenge you to recite the first chapter of the Quran without making mistakes. I think it is an easy challenge since you said you were a Muslim for a while. I responded by saying, I accept your challenge. So I accept your challenge to prove that I'm not a fake ex-Muslim by reciting the Quran by memory in Arabic and without recitation mistakes, even though I haven't recited it in about three years since I left Islam back in 2016. In fact, I will even blindfold myself by using my wife's blindfold to prove that I'm not reading from any text while reciting. But because I'm a born-again Christian, let me read to you the following verse of the Bible before I recite. Galatians chapter 3 verse 13 says, quote, Christ hath redeemed us from the curse of the law, being made a curse for us. For it is written, Cursed is every one that hangeth on a tree. The reason why I say that is because, the reason why I quote that is because I believe the Quran is a book of curses. Uh, unless you have God's Holy Spirit in you as a born again Christian believer, when reading the Quran and believing in it or reciting it, you are putting yourself under curses from Satan. So I am free from that. So here we go. Reciting from memory while blindfolded and without recitation mistakes. In Arabic, after three years of leaving Islam. Here we go. I'm not going to say Bismillahir Rahman Rahim because I don't believe in it. I'll just get right to the point with the first verse. Alhamdulillahi Rabbil Alameen Ar-Rahman Ar-Rahim Maliki Yawmiddin Iyaka Na'abudu Wa Iyaka Nasta'een Ihdina Sirat Al-Mustaqeem Sirat Al-Ladina An'amta Alayhim Ghayri Al-Maghdubi Alayhim Walad Dalleen. And I'm not saying amen or I mean to that because I don't believe in it. So there you go. That's proof that I'm not a fake ex-Muslim. God bless you in Jesus' name.